British Academy of Film and Television Arts, or BAFTA for short, has announced its nominations for the Game BAFTA Awards and, well, it looks as though Sony are going to nearly grab a clean sweep of the kudos on offer. There are plenty of award categories such as Animation, Artistic Achievement, Audio Achievement, Game Beyond Entertainment, Music and Narrative, and The Last of Us Part 2 is up for 13 of the 17 total categories, which is the most categories a game has been nominated for. It's perhaps no surprise really given how critically acclaimed The Last of Us Part 2 is, with NME.com saying, It's a humbling game that never feels like a slog across 30 hours of play, one that every PlayStation 4 owner should experience. But that's not the only PlayStation game looking like it'll grab the awards. Ghost of Tsushima has been nominated in 10 categories, while the newest PlayStation game on the list, Marvel's Spider-Man Miles Morales, is in 7 lists and even Dreams has 6 chances to win. And while it's not technically an exclusive for much longer, Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout is in the running for a potential 5 awards, though it's a testament to how much The Last of Us Part 2 may dominate that even Fall Guys appears in some categories that The Last of Us can't win, such as Evolving Game, Family Game, British Game, Multiplayer and Original Property, although Ghost of Tsushima appears in the Original Property category too, along with Hades, Spiritfarer, Kentucky Route Zero TV Edition and Carry On, so it's a very tough category to win, that one. Another interesting category to watch out for is Debut Game, since that focuses on titles from studios putting their first game out. Nominations include The Falconeer, Rurki, Factorio, Carry On, Call of the Sea and Airborne Kingdom. The winners of the BAFTA Game Awards will be announced on March 25th, and to find out more on this event and everything else in the world of gaming, head to NME.com.